Alright, and here we are with episode 6 of The Legend of Zelda's Ocarina of Times. And we're in the Dodongo's Cavern, which is the second dungeon in the game. Not a very long dungeon. It kind of seems like it's going to be long, but it's actually pretty quick. I forgot those statue things. I think they're called Bemo statues or something. I don't know. Uh, oh god. It looks like there are many lava pits around here. Wow, you are like Captain Obvious. So watch your step. Uh, there's a big goo dude over there. Uh, suddenly, I don't remember. Okay, these things come up. I think I'm gonna go over here first. Fuck your day up, didn't I? Alright, um, what's up there? Can I get up there? No, it's too hot, okay. So let's bomb this door over here. And yeah, the Hyrule shield's really good in here because there's lots of stuff that can burn your wooden shield.
Hey look, it's our first- this is why you want the, uh... Oh wow, I didn't expect them to go down that easy- oh my god, they're gonna explode! There we go. Yeah, cause they breathe fire and if they hit your little shield, you kind of, you know, burn it. Cause wood does that. I don't know what's in here, I don't remember. Can I deflect them with a shield? Hmm, does not seem so. Aha. Alright, you win. In return, I will sell you Deku sticks. One piece, 15 rupees. There. What? Your deal sucks. I'm gonna sell you my sticks for 15 rupees a piece. It's like, bitch, I can like, go, just go like find a tree and pick one up. Come on, breathe on me, breathe on me. Oh my god, why am I selling this shield equipped? Or just, you know, oh god. I thought he was gonna die from one hit. Boosh. Yeah. And now we're kept out on monies. I hear another one. Oh, what the fudge. Actually, I hear another one, so let's just go ahead and kill them all before I start doing the puzzles. Wow. Aha! And now you were defeated! What the fuck? Now you were defeated! What the? Your tail is not armored, sir. Okay, there we go. It's like, aha, I'm one of those new and improved doggos with armor plating everywhere. And that is not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Let's light you up. And you up. And you up. Alrighty. And now we're back out here. And I forget what the hell this does. Aha. Alright then. Oh shit! Oh, I hope this doesn't drop all the way into the lava. Okay, good. Cause that would kinda burn my booty. Heh <laughs> Uh, you can go in there, but I'm wondering what's behind door number two. A chest. It is probably the kitchen map. I forget 
how the fuck to beat these guys. You have to use bombs? I don't remember. Yep. And now he goes fucking insane! Ah, what? I was moving forward. 
What the fuck? I was moving forward, so we should have thrown it, and then he just places it right where he was. There you go, dick. Dick squeeze. And that was completely a waste of time. Whatever. He invoked my wrath. At first I was just toying with him, and he was like, Haha, I am like, smart and junk. And I was like, no you ain't. And then I just kind of blew him up. Alright then. So, yeah, I could have done that room in like two seconds, but instead I did it in like ten minutes. Let's see if I'm still awesome. Fuck. Aha! Oh, that did not go anywhere that I thought it would. Oh, close. Oh, what the fuck. Oh, son of a bitch. There we go. Did you see baby? Yeah. Oh, there's not a plan on the other side. Okay. Don't jump off. That would be extremely unfortunate. I know, God, you're like a freaking babysitter. Uh, can I just go straight up here, or do I have to? What is up here anyway? No, I wanted to turn around. I didn't want to get on the ladder again. No, Link. Chill out, bro. Ham. Actually, this is better. It's probably just money. But I think I need to use that, uh... Yeah. Uh, let's time this well. Close enough. Actually, I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna move this out real quick, because I'm curious. Well, I need that, so. Is there any reason to go over here? I don't remember. Don't think so, not from this way anyway. <coughs> Can I just jump and catch the ladder, or is it gonna make me push the damn thing back? Well, it would, you know, be nice if I angled it right, for starters. Wow. I blame the square, the square. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, every, t every time something goes wrong with moving, it's, it's the square analog stick's fault. It's just, that's just what it is. Actually, let's just do it like this. That's a lot better. Okay. Here we go. Moving on. Okay. This is like the hardest puzzle ever. Oh my god. Brother, what now? Bring it on. I'll do it to you too. I ain't got no 
Conscience, you started this. Aha. Victory's hard! This one's a little bit more tricky, I think, because you gotta, like, shoot one in that alcove to the left. Wow. Oh, I thought I missed again, and then I was gonna be like, bitch. There we go. Right, moving onward. Here's where I believe we get the bombs. stomach that is way too much information I don't know why you know they make bags specifically for holding bombs uh, I don't know what's behind there I don't think it's gonna make me fight those lizards again Holy crap, those things detonate fast.
Oh my god, stupid idiot.
like the Zelda equivalent of John Goodman in the film Arachnophobia. How the hell did I make that reference? It's me, Darunia. Well done. Thanks to you, I can now pound you in the face and not be accused of child abuse. What a wild adventure. It will make an incredible... Why am I... Okay, apparently he's the, the Goron version of uh, William Shatner now. I can't believe that Dodongo suddenly appeared in such great numbers. And that big rock blocking the cave. All this trouble must have been caused by that Garuda thief, Ganondorf. He said, give me the spiritual stone. Only then will I open the cave for you. Okay, I'm going to stop talking with that. You, on the other hand, risk your life for us. Kid, I like you. I want to have a love child. Oh, wait, what? How's it about you and I become sworn? Oh, that's pretty much just as worse. No, there's no big ceremony involved. I just have to cut your wrists. your hands in the air like you just don't care. I'm gonna need some water after this because my throat is quite parched. Yeah. You obtained the Goron's Ruby. This is the spiritual stone of fire passed down by the Gorons. You don't know what he means by sworn brothers, but it can't be anything good. You have one more spiritual stone to find. That's what the Zora is. Brother, you'll keep brush brushing up on your skills as you travel, won't you? You should go see the great fairy on top of the Death Mountain. She will power you up. Super Saiyan, motherfucker. Hey, everybody, let's see off our brother, and now it's raining Goron. You're dead great. I want to hug you and kiss you and squeeze you and... <laughs> Alright, so that's Dungeon Numero Dose complete. And that will do it for this episode. So join me next time. See ya.